Just look at these little, I only went in for one thing. Popcorns. I love these little trains. We've got two of these to go on our tree. So about that one. I love these as well. I've got these, just bought these in pink. Might have to get those ones as well. And look at these. <laughs> look at these houses. It's a madness. Very American, I love it. Oh, Jason, look at the sleigh. That's cool. Look at those sleighs, guys. Oh, gosh. It's for a gonk. Look. The gonk's already in there. Got some nice dinosaurs here, look. I like these. I haven't seen these before. They're actually solid. I like that they're all plastic as well, so they're great for trees if you've got young children, aren't they? Plastic. Some nice little topiary there. Can't really see that, there's a lot of glitzy stuff. Bows. Look at these, this is super, super cute. Love these. Oh, I can't believe they're back in. Super excited. Oh, they're nice. Have they got a mini one or is it just Mickey? It's just Mickey. 199. Are they empty? Yeah. Just Mickey. These are nice, aren't they? Yeah. Little sets. I love these as well, 5 99 for a cup. Yeah, they're definitely Mickey. <laughs> are they? <laughs> they're all Mickey. Okay. Peeking. It's home bargain haul time. <laughs> Stocking challenge. Yeah, which I lost. Overspent. I think no. I lost because I underspent. So I didn't. We had a 20. So the challenge is mum v dad, £20 each. Uh. And do you mind? <laughs> and I didn't even get to £20. I, did, I spent 16 so I didn't do very well for them at all in home bargains. But there you go. And, and what did I you spend? Spent. You overspent. Okay. Should we do Rowan and then we'll do Isla? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Well, first of all, I think I'll do all of the sweets that I got him. That's not sweets. Is that right? Nope. Still going. <laughs> so I got Rowan some Santa Clauses. And I think these were like 79p. They're definitely under a pound. Quite a lot in there. Milk chocolate Santa, so I think they're just plain milk chocolate. Some little Paw Patrol lollies, and these are 99p. And they do Barbie ones, Paw Patrol, I'm not sure what else they do. Um, oh, like uh, My Little Pony ones. So I must do some of the boys ones as mm. well, but I only saw those ones. I've got him a little train. That's cool. And I think this was really cheap. I think this was like 59p. 469p I can be wrong but I like the fact that he can use I can fill it each year with coins for him so I'll definitely reuse it and then we've just bought him a little Christmas tree haven't we yeah we've got either a little green one for 10 pounds no we've got no. Rowan a little green one for 10 pounds and either a little pink one for 10 pounds they're quite big actually aren't they mm. from um, they're bigger than they look from home bargains no from B&Q oh yeah so if you're after like a nice tree for a boys room or a girls room, I'd go and have a look and be in key because for £10 they're, they're quite high so they're really quite nice and they're also quite skinny, they're not too bulky Yeah. and they don't have, they've got glitter on them and not fake snow and I hate fake snow in the bedroom because it just goes everywhere so yeah, that's his little tin I got him another little chocolate lolly <laughs> a chocolate reindeer and that was 99p and then these were also 99p and just loads of little lollies um, they're cool. Yeah, they are cool. And they have like some of the back to cover it. Oh, yeah, they have. There you are. They've got a picture to cover in. Well done. I didn't see that. That's cute. Hmm. Um, then I got my little um, recorder whistle. Um, just made of wood. I think this was about 2 99 
probably going to drive me absolutely mad <laughs> and I think he's going to more enjoy banging the whistle against the box because it comes, comes in an actual little wooden box which to be honest is quite nice you could you could keep that and put other little bits and bobs in he likes drumming um and then I've just got him a load of books because I just did not see anything else so I've got this really nice one two three book um and it just basically goes up to 10 and I love the fact that they can actually count on here so it's not you know one two three four five six you can really teach them with that so I think it's easy for a parent to teach it's not natural born teachers um is it 50 <laughs> yeah we found that out in lockdown didn't we yeah <laughs> <laughs> oh yes so you've got and then you've got 20 50 and 100 on there which I think is great I think it's just great uh and I've got a touchy feely book for him, which I really actually love. The many 250. Um, and then it just follows all the way through. And then when you move the pages, it's got holes. So it's just really textural and sensory. Um feels really weird. Yeah, so like rubbery. Yeah. I think it'd be good for autistic children. Yeah. Children with sensory needs, it's a really great book. And then just this Christmas wish book. And I say these are about six pounds on Amazon. And I think they're one fifty nine in B and M, so they're a bit cheaper in B and M. But I found this one in Home Bargains. We love Peter Rabbit, don't we? So had to get him that. And then I found just a little spelling book. Um, so we just have to flip the pages, and eventually he'll get matching that matching um, the words. Matching so I'll get word, cat, yeah. yeah, matching picture and words. So I really like that for his spelling. 99p you can't go wrong for something for him to grow into and then i got him this play-doh mat this big play-doh mat which i just think is a really great little gift 250 i think it was um 150 centimeters by 150 centimeters so it's pretty big actually uh and i thought he's got some play-doh um he's getting into art and things and yeah he's just hit 18 months so i just thought i can actually roll that round like that and it'll go in his stocking just thought it was quite a good little gift and you know it's a good gift if you're giving to your, a parent i think that's yeah. a great gift if you know that someone's got <coughs> young children i think that's a great gift i'd love to receive that because mm. it keeps yeah. my floor clean yeah and then mum my mother's just got some gifts as well to go in their stockings which she's got either a lolly a <laughs> lovely candy cane lolly just really beautiful from the sweet shop near you know where she lives and then one for Rowan, which he won't eat. No, Isla might end up either, having a good yeah. go, but my mum can't give one without the other. And then she's just got these really beautiful chocolates. And I do know that they do these little chocolates in the range. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, these say one ninety nine on, so from the sweet shop, but I think they're about a pound. They might even be one ninety nine in the range, but yeah. So I thought they were really, they were they're really lovely, and they're exactly the same print, so uh, it's nice. Yeah, no idea. So everything I got for Rowan, I spent sixteen pounds, and I think my mum spent four forty. So I think my mum's budget clearly was about five pounds for them. Can I do a very nice? Yeah, go on. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, go for it. So I hear this crystal trench play doh, which comes in little rings. She can play with her when she's going out. It's so much better on the sides. She's better on the sides. There you are. Yeah. Bit it's different, isn't it? Thing. It's like really shiny, glistery play doh. Like Slime. Slimy type. Yeah. Well, we don't really Stuff. know what it is, do we? No. It looks like glitter, like it's got glitter in, so. Yeah. Or beads or something in there. It's probably a surprise for us as well. Yeah. I think she'll love the fact that she can wear on her fingers. I think she'll love that. I think it'll be fun. I think they're a nice, actually, a nice little thing that once the slimes have it, they've got a little, little ring, ring container yeah. that they can put beads or all sorts of keepsakes in. <laughs> little girls would love that, wouldn't they? Yeah. So she's just getting to the age where she... Stinks? ...wants smellies, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she likes having her own smelly She likes to stink up the place with yeah. this. So I got her this... Body Mistrio. She loves hand cream, doesn't she, at the yeah. minute? 
which is a sweety fruity scent, bubblegum scent and candy floss scent. Oh, so. <laughs> very smelly. Yeah. yeah. But, yeah. I'll oh, twist them around, they are, for a picture. So, yeah, she'll enjoy How those. How much were those? Two nines, Something like that, yeah. Oh, I think the crunch was 3 50 wasn't it? Yeah. The rings, the Play Doh rings were up to 3 50 Same sort of thing. So, got a unicorn mist, which. That's it, that's yeah. better. Yeah. So it's a unicorn head, which has got perfume in it. So, a day, same it's logic same she thing. likes. Wild berry scented perfume, mm. six plus years. So I think she's gonna adore that. It's gonna be really nice for her. It's the first year she's had like more grown up things, isn't it? Yeah. So, she likes having her feet rubbed at school, which Again, sounds a bit odd, but she's... They do a spa yeah. thing at the school, because a lot of the children um, in her class have got um, movement issues, and they can get very stiff and very sore, yeah. so I really like her hands being massaged, but her wrists, they come in with cerebral palsy, so she really likes like, a stretch, and I put nice cream on her arms and do her stretching and um, manipulate her hands and her joints and things to get them more mobile, and she just loves her smelly... Yeah. cream and again the same for her feet really yeah so i've got this blushed peony calming foot rub and socks <laughs> or foot lotion and i'm socks. gonna have great fun doing that each night <laughs> so yeah so she can have her but she likes to wear socks in bed doesn't she yeah. she gets really cold feet with her condition yeah. she gets she's got that's lovely yeah yeah sherry you're so good at buying gifts Marina, where are my gifts i thought she loved to do some america go on then I don't get no home games gift, so. She's also got these lip balms. Torn Red Disney. And it's cold. It's a bit of cold, isn't it? Yeah. Um, Even when you're out in the sun as well, you get really dry lips. Yeah. Do you know it's the so, wind, isn't it? It's the wind when you're walking out in Disney because you're out a lot. Yeah, outside a lot. You're out a lot. Um, but when we go in March, the wind can be quite brutal and it's just, just, just very drying. These were all 99p. So I got a little cupcake bath bomb. Put it down a little bit. Oh, that's cute. A rainbow bath bomb. It smells amazing. Which is got multicolored in it. So that bath's going to be. It fizzes out like a rainbow, doesn't it? It's one yeah. of those that fizzes out like a rainbow that was. They're quite, I think they're like two nine nine on Amazon. Doesn't smell much. Doesn't smell as much. And a star with the same sort of multicoloured. I don't think this it. one does the same as the other one. But this one smells so good. It smells so <laughs> nice, this one. This one is, is the winner for the smellies. Got the little Santas. Oh, same Rome's as Rome's Dog. So they were about located about 79p. Yeah, we didn't shop together. He went one way and I went the other way. I had the trolley and I bought a lot of Christmas decks as well. And these little puds, which are... I think they've got popping candy in it. They're yeah. popping puds. So they're Feline and popping candy. You made a joke, didn't you, that you got some pop... He <laughs> made a joke pugs. that you got some popping pugs. And I said, what? And he was like, yeah, <laughs> popping pugs. And I was, I was, I just didn't have a clue what he meant. But he, me he meant puds, not pugs. <laughs> And got this egg. You don't know what this egg is. No, no idea. They're very but cheap though, said, aren't they? Yeah. I think it was like one fifty or fifty. I don't. I don't even know if it was a pound. It's supposed to have a toy the in there. The only clue is know. there's a prize inside on the bottom. So yeah, I don't think there'll be a surprise for her and a surprise for us because we have no idea what's in it. <laughs> but it shakes. I think it might just be like a cheap Kinder Egg version. Yeah. I think. So probably we'll open it and it'll just be like a Kinder Egg and then there'll be like a little tiny toy in the middle of it. Oh, it's a Kinder Egg. And this mini pen. So again, this is a good size for the characters to be signing autographs in the parks. And it's a multicoloured multi-pen. So 
that would be nice for an old scraps really it? yeah really it's nice if you took a frame to sign to different yeah. colors a lot of people take loads of different sharpies it might be a nice little gift if you're going to disney actually or and if she meets mickey or minnie they'll love the we do character interaction moment as well because it's me on the top yes yeah, nice little pen that's all of mine is that yeah no no reason oh he's lying for a chocolate santa oh have i got a chocolate santa for this you can have a chocolate santa if you want a chocolate santa <laughs> I haven't got you one. Yeah. I thought our own had a chocolate reindeer. Yeah. He's eating it. No, he's got a chocolate reindeer. I got him a reindeer. Did you show it? Yeah. Yeah. I did, yeah. He's been paying attention to these pads. So I'm surprised nothing has gone missing. <laughs> oh, is he? <laughs> yeah. Well, we're going to put it away now, aren't we? Mm hmm. Well, out of his reach. So yeah, that's everything we got for our stocking. So who do you think wins the stocking competition? Especially as I didn't really spend 20 and you spent over 20. It won't tell me what you spent, <laughs> but I haven't seen the receipt either. So I want to know how much you spent. But um, yeah. 24 ish, so. maybe. And the nice one's 16. Ish. So technically we're not out of pocket, really. No. I don't. I think Rowan's going to be so overwhelmed with what he's got anyway. Yeah. Um, and we're going to do next week. Um, probably at Monday. I'm going to do it over the weekend. Everything my mum got for Rowan for Christmas, and then we will be on to really doing Ida's birthday vlogs. Yeah. Uh, because she's got a lot. She's got a big birthday haul, and it's her birthday. We've got a bowling party. So we've got loads and of stuff she's coming up. It's just a big birthday as well, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm gonna buy a Costco cake and try and decorate it <laughs> into something special. I don't know. I'm not making one. I'm gonna she's buy one. She's ten. So tell you so My mum was having immense fun telling me earlier. What? How old I was? You are old. I know. I've been saying to her for years. Anyway, moving on from how ancient we now are. <laughs> um. Thanks for watching. Thanks for rolling with the happy odds. Thanks for getting this far if you have. Please like and subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> and thank you for rolling with the happy odds. I got it in for you. <sighs> also, there is a prize draw for when we get to 250 subscribers. Which I yes, you need to find that video and comment on it. Get on that. It's a lovely Halloween print that we got in Florida.